Hi everyone, it's Shane from Hanlon's again for another Maintenance Monday. And today we're gonna to talk to you about conveyor maintenance. At this time of the year, lots of guys are starting to use their conveyors. The fertilizer companies are wanting to ship out fertilizer and so you're, you're loading fertilizer into your bins or you're loading pulse crops out to sell. Um, we just wanna quickly go over and give you a few pointers on things that you wanna look at especially before you get into that busy season um, you get a cool day and then all of a sudden something fails on your conveyor so maybe we can help you out here so first thing to look at we're, we're just looking at a at a big conveyor here this is a 15100 so it applies to your 1565 through 15100 uh, first thing you want to look at is um, have a look in you can you can look in through the side here and you can Take the shield off on the other side but you can have a look in and have a quick look at your drive roll to see what the what the, the rubber looks like there as far as if there's any any driving surface left on your drive roll uh, check your chains of course and then the other thing that you want to look at is to go in here and look at your transfer conveyor and look at the drive roll as well there uh, usually it gives you an idea if you get in there with a flashlight or you, you open up the door and get inside that you can take a screwdriver and pull the edge of the belt back and see if the belt is starting to, to delaminate a bit. Um, have a look at that, have a look at the lacing. You, you know, of course, check for leaks and things like that. But the main thing is we want you to look at your drive rolls. It also applies on your 1547s, 1545s, 2045s. Open, open that up, have a look at it so that it's not slipping and you get a failure when you want to use it. Thanks for watching. Hopefully that helps.